there really is a lot to be learned from, from the penguins. And they're phenomenal divers. These birds can dive to 25, 27 minutes, and then 500 meters. So how they do that is, is really still a little bit of a mystery in some respects. My name is Cassandra Williams, and I'm a graduate student working on my PhD with Paul Ponganis, and we are out here on the sea ice in McMurdo Sound studying emperor penguins. We really look at their diving physiology and a little bit of diving behavior. This is my third time in Antarctica. I came first in 2005, and then we were here last year, and then this year. If you sit at a colony for you know, less than five minutes, they will come up to you, and they're just so curious. So they want to know what you're doing, what you are, and so I set up a camera at Cape Crozier, and the second I set up the camera, there was two penguins right there looking at me, trying to figure out what I was doing, and it was great. I took a little bit of a different path getting to where I am. I was a lawyer for a little while and then I decided I didn't want to do that. So um, I volunteered on some projects. One project I volunteered on, the scientist I worked with was named Jeff Seminoff, really convinced me that I could change completely from being a lawyer to going back to school and studying biology. So I think he was one of the first people who inspired me to, to really go after this dream. And then after that, my parents were incredibly supportive, giving up a pretty lucrative career as a lawyer to go be a biologist was a big change. And then, um, and then when I was studying biology, I, I read a book called Weddell Seal Consummate Diver by Jerry Pointman. And it was about research in Antarctica. And I thought, that sounds like the most fun thing I could ever think of to do. And so after reading that, I um, started on this journey. And here I am doing the most fun thing I could think of. For me, coming from a background of being a lawyer and switching to biology, I think like the best part of studying biology is you get to ask any question you want. And the things you wonder about are the things you get to figure out. Like I, when I was studying biology very early on, I thought, how do these animals stay underwater so long? And that's what I get to study. It takes a lot longer than I thought it would to figure out. But you get to ask these great questions and then figure out how to answer them. And then go to places like Antarctica and in fact answer them. <laughs>